If 50 would fight Stevie, then I would fight Eminem. And then it would be the biggest pay-per-view celebrity boxing match in the history of this world. Steve's and 50, me and Eminem. It would be crazy. And put us on the undercard of Jake Paul and Mike Tyson. I need that to happen, y'all. I'll fight Eminem. It's six fucking ounce gloves. Like, come on. Them shit is damn near pillows. Fuck is scared of. You know what I'm saying? Sleeves and 50. My money on sleeves all day. I know sleeves are not 50. Yeah, that's just my opinion. And I'll knock Eminem out 30 seconds into the round. Let's just do it. Let's do it. Let's get this bag. People want to see it. Let's do it. I need y'all to tag somebody. Put this out. Okay? Shady and G universes, the good, the good guys. You want to throw Tony Yale in there, we get Peter Guns. Fuck it. Be loving hip hop. If you want to throw somebody else in, we'll get Cisco. The loving hip hop boys. Yeah, I would demolish him. I would beat the shit out of Eminem in a boxing match. No question. There's no question about it. I would dust him off, dog walk him, yeah. all that. You know what I'm saying? Let's make it happen, all right? We need y'all to make this happen. It's just celebrity boxing. It's not serious. It ain't all that serious. People get so serious. Entertainment. It's just, you know what I'm saying? It's three rounds, two minute rounds. You know what I'm saying? 16 ounce gloves. Like, come on. If Jake win is fixed, no question. I don't give a fuck. Ain't no fucking way. Not with Mike's hitting. Nah, I can't see it. Oh, I would love to fight Joe Buttons. Oh, my God. I'll tell you what. I'll fight Joe Button for free. I'll do that for charity. I will break Joe Button's jaw for charity. <laughs> for real. It's Roy Stavis on the check in. Now I'm all for men selling their differences in a boxing match and all that. But it starts to sound like clown show when you say things like, oh, let's get Stevie J in it, Peter Guns, Cisco. I'm about to let the dragon out. And you know, this can be the cast of Love, Love and Hip Hop against Eminem and G Unit, 50 Cent, Tony Ayo. Yo, like, Benzino knows that Eminem's not going to do something like this. This is just his way of continuing his press run against him. But let's be hypothetical here. Uh, Benzino's 58 years old. Google says he's five foot three. Eminem's 51 and he's five foot eight. Eminem once said that he used to run, what was it? Uh, 15, 16 miles a day when he was addicted to drugs. Benzino's obviously jacked up with his physique, but you know, both those things don't really mean nothing. So, I mean, I don't know who'd win between the two. I really don't care at this point. Now, if it was just them two and they had a real issue here, I'd be all for it, but it's not a real issue. It's just more of a way to, you know, milk out the publicity and all that. Until something happens to Benzino, I do believe he's just gonna continue this press run. I mean, unless somebody actually does something to him, I don't think he's gonna shut up about it. And you can't be mad at Benzino because Eminem is the one that let the shot off on that doomsday. So Benzino's doing what he's supposed to as far as you know, uh, benefiting from being dissed against, you know, the big, one of the largest artists in hip hop period. But anyway, let me know how y'all feel about it in the comments. Y'all think this is good. Y'all think this is stupid. Let me know. And of course, if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe.